Hi, hello everyone. My name is Sophia and I am one of the members of No Call team. Today I want to introduce you basic tools of No Call and I'm going to open the software. Just create one room. And I can just write the title, choose general mood, full HD, and create in the inter. Hello, my name is Sophia. And make sure that the cam is selected. And also check your microphone. Make sure you see these orange bars. It's picking up your voice. And here we can check the speaker test. If I click here, I should able to hear the music in my ears. It's just to tell you that your headset, whatever speakers you're using, is working. So I'm going to enter. So as you can see, I have already two students. I call my co-workers and the opposing students today just to help us to learn some of the features and there are two parts of the blackboard on the right side is a stage and uh, you can see here eight students plus this the teacher uh, total nine people at one time on the stage and this are, there are some ways to interact with them for example, if I click to myself, I'll be on the left side of the blackboard and I can drag, just resize. If I want the bigger or well, smaller, if I double click to myself, I go back to the, my seat. It's also same with my students. I can just interact with them easily. Double click. Yes. They are on the, their seats. Okay. And uh, here, if uh, you can see, if I mouse over to my student video feed, I can see these four buttons. The first one is the authority. Uh, authority is enabling the student to do something with the blackboard or use a screen sharing. And if I click, they can interact, easily interact with the blackboard. You can see here green button. And if I click, it's a red one. The second one is a microphone. If you see the red one, it means the student is muted. If I click, you can say hello. 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 Yes, we can hear him. I'm going to mute him. The third one is a trophy. If the performance of the student is good, we can give a trophy. Like this. Yes, it's good. And the fourth one is a private chat. Now I'm talking to my student one and the student two can hear us anymore. If I click again, the student too is also with us. Okay, here we have three buttons. The first one is a screenshot. If I click screenshot, it's successfully us taken and I'm going to pass it. Just, you can use control V. Yes, here the screenshot. Also, I can replace it or resize it, whatever size I want. I will delete that. The second one is a screen sharing and third one is a start recording. This recording will be saved in the cloud disk. Yes, if I want to mute all the people, I use this permission. If I click, they can't open their microphone and it's global muted. Yes, I will click it again. Here is my stuff. The first one is the microphone, camera, and the volume of the speaker. Yes, here you can see the name of the members. Okay, and let's go to the left side. This is an interactive blackboard. 
and we have a lot of tools just let me start from the basic cursor it's just a basic i can just drag whatever i want to do the second one is a select button uh, for example i need to select something this is the logo of the no call i just want to drag on right side i can easily move the stuff for example just here like this okay and the third one is the brush you can choose the colors the thickness and we have the shapes also so i'm going to choose the color for example pink and just can draw something here or choose the shape whatever shape i want if i want the seeker just i choose this one okay just let me undo this all the stuff i want to ask my students to write here a b c d in 20 seconds and i have also opened the timer tool for example 20, in 20 seconds please use the brush and the right here in your lines but the firstly i need to open the authority to them yes please be prepared in three seconds we're gonna to start one two three 20 seconds 19 yes here we go we can see the lines it's a b C, D, yeah, you're the same in 12 seconds. Good job, guys. I'm gonna give you the trophy. Good job. If you have another, you can just reset and start again. I'm going to close it. And the next is the text box. Uh, I'm gonna choose the color, for example red and uh, the side is x sludge and i need to choose the place hello world and i can choose a select button to replace it wherever place i want so yes and now we're going to picture i have the picture in my photo and need to if upload I to the blackboard i just open my camera and scan this qr code you can just use this picture we have also the second option it's upload from the local it means from your computer yes and we are going to the next tool it's the yonder as we can see we do the redo also and for the next tool, let me open the one PPT, for example, this PPT, and I can use this laser and show the students where I am. For example, this is logo, this is lamp, this is students and teacher, this is a laptop, and it's really easy to interact with it okay the next is the cloud disk you can open and if you have any files in any formats to upload from the computer to this blackboard or to this no call software you just click the upload and the choose the file also here you can manage for example the new to open the new folder and uh, more delete, move, copy, or rename the file also. Yes, we're going to the next one. For example, tools. I'm going to use this quiz tool today. I have already prepared the question to my students. And uh, here we have two options, but I want to do the three options. And I need to go to the... To my computer and choose the picture just paste it i want it 
resize also going to click the text box to write the answer for example c i'm going to correct it with select button yes i have here three options so i need to deduct one if i have for example five options i can just add them but i have three so let me delete it and right now i need to choose the correct answer before the start this tool right now my students can see so the answer is in which sport participants compete as individuals the correct answer we know this one so i need to choose i'm going to start we can see the statistics yes here you can see the details yeah in two seconds the student one is answered correct uh, here we see the green color it means correct and that this one red color is incorrect good job i'm going to give you the trophy so i'm going to end with this tool okay if you have any questions also you can choose one more time and start it again so the next tool is a timer we have used it before and also stopwatch it's kind of similar if i'm going to start it the students can see the counting it's really good when you're doing for example debate or discussion something so i can just pause also reset or continue the counting or i'm going to close it right now so the next tool i'm going to introduce you is a responder tool i have prepared another question the question is what kind of animal is this the number of answers is one and i am going to start please students three seconds to preparation and 10 seconds for answer what kind of animal is this yes yeah, student two is going to answer right now please write your answer here and panda that's correct i'm going to give you the trophy for excellent job also you have if you have another question you can restart again and um, yes i'm going to close it our next tool is the a board i'm going to introduce you this tool here we can see the preparing it's like a small blackboard but right now this screen students can see only just me so i'm going to write here for example just letters a b c d and i'm going to ask my students to write in your small words a b c d also using the brush please so here the student a as we can see started to write student two is also yes that's correct if we have the lot of yeah student a is done student two is also if we have a lot of students we just can click this button and uh, look which student we have a b c d if i click to the collect button and this screen again go back to me it's collecting and uh, this kind of explaining for example i'm going to explain yes this is a this is b and this is c and d yes okay i'm going to close it and just give you guys again the trophy you did the great job okay and the one more feature is the save blackboard if i need to save this blackboard i just click here save and uh, in the next class 
I just click this open button and that time this stuff is gonna be here again but also if I leave from here my blackboard is saved automatically will be saved okay and uh, I'm going to just introduce you chat here are the announcements also if I have the announcement for my students I can just open the announcement and right here his announcement or I have just say something to myself for example good job guys the guys will be see from here and also I can drag the chat here just here but I I'm just going to close it so yes that's all and I'm really happy to introduce you some tools some features of Nucle if you have any questions please do not hesitate to contact us and uh, by link uh, you can download our software in our official website and uh, see you next time I'm very thankful to my students and my co-workers also. I'm going to leave and if I choose this button, I can leave this classroom. So thank you so much and bye-bye. Uh, See you next time.